reported today in The Verge. Everything you need to know about the new coronavirus in China. Public health experts around the globe are scrambling to understand, track, and contain a new virus that appeared in Wuhan, China at the start of December. You can see where and how many cases have been reported in this real-time map created by U.S. researchers. So far, there have been over 550 confirmed cases and 17 deaths. The majority of the illnesses are in Wuhan, but cases have been reported in South Korea, Japan, Taiwan, Thailand, Macau, Hong Kong, and the U.S. As this important story continues to unfold, The Verge will update this page with all the latest news and analysis. Our hope is to answer all your questions as people work to understand this virus and contain its spread. Table of Contents Where did the virus come from? So is this the same as SARS? China lied to the WHO about SARS. Are they lying about this, too? How dangerous is this new virus? I've been coughing. Do I have this virus? How can I protect myself? Should I cancel my trip to China? How is China trying to stop the virus? How at risk is the United States? Where did the virus come from? At the end of December, public health officials from China informed the World Health Organization that they had a problem, an unknown, new virus was causing pneumonia-like illness in the city of Wuhan. They quickly determined that it was a coronavirus, and that it was rapidly spreading through and outside of Wuhan. Coronaviruses are common in animals of all kinds, and sometimes can evolve into forms that can infect humans. Since the start of the century, two other coronaviruses have jumped to humans, causing the SARS outbreak in 2002 and the MERS outbreak in 2012. Scientists think this new virus first became capable of jumping to humans at the beginning of December. It appears to have first infected people at a seafood market in Wuhan, and spread from there. The type of animal the virus originated from is not clear. One team of researchers in China published a report arguing that it came from snakes, based on the genetic code of the virus. However, the study didn't actually detect the new virus in a snake, they just created a model based on how the virus's genes predict it would behave, so scientists are still skeptical of that conclusion. Another analysis found that the genetic sequence of the new virus is 96% identical to one coronavirus found in bats. Both SARS and MERS originated in bats. So is this the same as SARS? The new virus isn't SARS, although that also began in China. Because it comes from the same viral family as SARS, it has some similarities, but it's an entirely new virus. However, the commonalities mean scientists and public health officials can use what they've learned from the past outbreak to try to stop this one. China lied to for more on this story, visit the news article link.